sharpness and the, the straight vision of goal is not about the huge fight with others. It's more than a fight with my inner self of changing myself and, and being diligent of what I'm doing. My name is Martins Rubenis and uh, I've been a former Olympic athlete for participating in five Olympic Games. When I was a little kid, I think, at uh, nine, nine or ten years old, then that's, that's the time when I started to learn how to, how to do luge. From that time I had coaches who've been uh, teaching me to be like a shark and very sharp on, on my goals and what I want to uh, reach. I started to building my sleds already like 15 years ago when I understood that uh, there is no way to buy something that is better than others. So if you want to really to become a top athlete, then you need to find your own way how to build a sled. I've started practicing Falun Duff uh, about 10 years ago. It was uh, spring of 2005. Before I started practicing Falun Gong, my, my body actually was in a very bad shape. I was like 20 something years old, but I felt like 45 because my back was hurting, my, my muscles were hurting and, and I couldn't really do my best uh, in, really in the sports I, I've been doing. And only just when I started practicing, just in the, after the first time I, I tried exercises, I feel the, really a lot of energy going through it and really opening up my back and it was cracking and and uh, really changing. I was I was sweating like a, in, in a hard training, but I knew that there is something big just happening, and I just didn't know what it is, but I, I felt that it's all good. <laughs> and yeah, in, in about uh, one and a half month, all the pain I had in my back and my body it, it just disappeared. I feel that first thing that I I uh, started to realize and understand that I have to become more selfless, less selfish. Uh, what I understood through the practice, that the more open you are, the more, more good you receive. The more good you give, the more good you receive. It made me, from one point when I was building my own sleds, I. I was hiding them, I was keeping them for me before practice. And after I start practicing, I, I understood that principle that I need to share more. So there is more things to come. And that's not, not just one thing that I found. It's really something very special and important. And when I share it with others, then the new knowledge should come and new ideas should come. And that's what I felt and that's what really happened. <laughs> I really understood, understood the meaning of how the body and soul and mind is connected. That even as an athlete I can go to the certain level, but when I don't improve my mind, my character, and when I don't improve it in my everyday life, I, I, can, I can't become better.
I become a coach and a mechanic engineer who is helping our Olympic team to to get uh, another good results, but from another side of the wall. <laughs> Let's go. 